All right, this is the inside of the 66 Valiant, and this is what I've been driving uh, while the 74 is out of commission. So anyway, I came in here uh, simply to check the oil and add a little bit because I knew it needed some. And let me just see what happens when you find a uh, aluminum spacer and two steel washers just sitting on the engine block like that. Obviously, it immediately comes to mind is where the fuck did those come from? They had to come from above. Now, where they appear to have come from is right above here, which would make sense. There's no bolt here, you notice, and I haven't found the bolt anywhere else hung up on the body. But if we look up, right here is the top mount for the exhaust manifold. Um, so that's that's where these came from. These are used to offset because usually the bolts are varying size and they also provide a bit of washer action as they're supposed to. Um, anyway, I don't know that I have a bolt like that. These are all studded actually. They're not bolts, they're studs with nuts on the front. So I'll see if I have a bolt that size. If I don't, I'm a little fucked and I'll drive it as is and then figure out another way. But I'm going to have to re, well not torque them, but make sure that they're all intact. And then, uh, so that none of the others will fall out, but, uh, oh, I found something. Oh, uh, that's going to make things difficult. Motherfucker sheared off. So that just adds an extra level of complexity. That is unfortunate because it means I won't be able to put a bolt in there. And it also means that hole is super fucked. So I, I have no choice but to drive this now as is. Yeah, see these these would have been uh, washers right on the uh, on the end there. Provide some better clamp down, but uh, at some point those two parts came apart suddenly, and uh, there it's totally totally fucked. Not something necessarily I want to see on what I'm trying to use every day, but um, it, it, yeah, it's not going to prevent me from driving it does make me curious about whether the, any other ones are loose and whether I'll start losing more. I really haven't taken these manifolds off since I bought the car because it's such a pain in the ass to put back on. It looks terrible. Like It, it, it just looks like a job and a half. The way that they're, the two manifolds are interlinked, you know, the exhaust, intake, exhaust, intake, exhaust. Um, it looks like a total pain in the ass, and it looks like it'll leak at the drop of a hat. People end up putting all this gum, you know, like they... Treat it not only with gasket, but with goo and shit. And just by the way it's built, you can tell people uh, really hate this fucking job. But anyway, that, uh, yeah. You can kind of see the pattern on there. It just it yanked it right off. Anyway, it's more fun. But, uh, yeah, this isn't going to stop me. We're, we're, we're driving anyway. Thanks. Have a good day. Talk soon. Bye.